Here they come, your top cuts of the week, all exclusively presented by our good friends at Buckeye Horizon. We're gonna get out and run here to start the countdown, but get ready for a big scourge as Cinderberg's EV Snow hits the brake check and drills the short range J. We're gonna run it back in slow motion now so that you can admire EV tugging on that E brake for the bucket and a big win for the Lady Trojans. Football season may be over, but Clear Fork drawn up a Hail Mary bomb at the Colt Corral, and this one's going for six. Well, maybe just two points for Bo Dornbrier, who snuck behind the defense for a wide open layup. But as we take a second look, Adam Van Ostel showcases the rocket arm as the lefty goes deep and the play call works to perfection, ending in the end zone with the student section. Thought we were in line for a competitive game at the Birdcage on Saturday with a pair of 19-win teams, but Corey Vermilia had other plans, cashing in the theft with a slick reverse layup, finishing with a right hand on the left side. Check out this gorgeous step through as well as the Loudonville senior standout. Turn some defense into points. We head to the castle at top cut number seven. Loose ball up for grabs is gonna end with Hunter Folk, who turns in some loose change for a two point reward. And in spectacular fashion, as the video obviously shows, take a second look at the fancy finish highlighted by a nice bit of hang time. It's ladies night in Shelby, which featured a fun rivalry showcase highlighted by a nice hesitation here by Eve Schwemley, who loses the handle, but has the wherewithal to regather for the dime, all in one motion, as she finds Sarah Riser for the hoop. Nice move here by Eve and a win over Willard, keeping her concentration to set up Sarah for a point blank bucket. Join me at the mountaintop now for play number five for Cayman Isles. Watch this. He's gonna snatch the ball right out of the offensive player's clutches with a nasty block, sends it ahead to Brock Montgomery, and the long sleeved Ram will finish off the play in style. I mean, this is a pretty unbelievable block. Watch it again. Bam, right there. And then as they go the other way, a sharp head fake at the other end. The defender flies by and the Rams cruise by Buckeye Central at home. More from Loudonville's Vermilia in our top four now. No balance, no problem for Corey. Flipping it up as she's sitting sideways like Paul Wall in a daze. And like the people's champ, Corey looking icy with this acrobatic bucket. At number three, let's head down 71 to Westerville North where it was senior night for the Warriors and Vari Adams was celebrating above the rim. Crazy hang time and a beautiful setup too. One of four dunks on the night for Vari, but none more spectacular than this transition alley-oop. More dunks coming up at the top two spot and nobody slows down Davion Mack. So he's gonna rock the rim like a wrecking ball. Such force for this freshman who checked in at number one on my countdown last week with another monster dunk, but we gotta see this again. Max skies high from the volleyball line and put some hot sauce on the delicious smash burger. But at number one this week, we go back to warrior country where thank goodness there was security cause Ian Robinson catching a body, son. His teammates reactions tell you everything that you need to know as the Westerville North duo each got a big dunk, but wow, what a killer one right there for top cut number one. 